unpredictable and, and what you're going to have to look for with him. Uh, he's a pretty good quarterback, high in the candidate, as we all know. Uh, he's a mobile threat. He has that uh, zone read aspect to his game, and he really wants to get, get call his own number a lot when he gets down to the goal line. So if we get to stop with him, the quarterback run and zone read, I mean, make him one-dimensional, I mean, he kind of take away one of his uh, great things that he did. Does he, you go against Baker Mayfield every day, are there any similarities between those two? Yeah, they're both mobile threats, and uh, I feel like Baker's a little bit better, but it's just my personal opinion, but I feel like we're getting a, a better a better look at a quarterback and we to go a bit good on good and things like that. So. Does he remind you of anybody that you've played so far? Uh, Tennessee's quarterback, Eric Dobbs, they kind of had the same. Want to run the ball a lot, don't really want to put the ball in the air, want to call their own number a lot. Talk about Wayne Gallman, Clemson's running back. What do you see out of that guy? Pretty, he's, a, he's a very good running back, very patient. When uh, find the right holes, when he finds that hole, he gets downhill. So you really have to stop that guy or he can make the game a long game for us. Last year, Oklahoma did a great job of stopping the inside run. In fact, they did a great job of stopping the run. What was the key last year? Um, I mean, just staying, playing that technique and trying to run to the ball. I mean, I guess it didn't work too good. I mean, it got, they beat us 40 to 6, but... We have a new team, so I guess it's going to be energy, bring energy at all times of the game, not worrying about the heat, uh, not partying too much, and just, just going out there and playing 100 miles per hour. Last year's bowl game had an extra dimension playing them this year. No, not really because it's a new team. It's two new teams. I mean, we lost a lot of seniors. They lost a lot of seniors. So we're going out there, two new teams, and we want to, we want to start our own thing. We're trying to get away from that from last year, but we definitely still feel it for the Saints last year, but this is a new season for us. Clemson does tombstones after <laughs> ranked wins. What was your thought when you saw that the first time? Just kind of burst it off. I mean, if they needed that little positive energy or that little tombstone thing, we just kind of looked at it and kind of laughed at it. We knew it was all fun in the game, so it didn't really affect us too much. Biggest difference from what you see Clemson this year is the quarterback play. Uh, quarterback play, their running back, and they have a great tight end. I mean, and they always have great receivers, but that tight end and that running back, if we if we don't uh, get a handle with them quick, I mean, they can make the game a very long game. They can throw points very quick like any Big 12 team can. Sib Watson reminds you of Dobbs, but offensively, does Clemson remind you of any team that you've played? They remind us like a Big 12 team. I mean, they want to zone read you. They want to get some quick screens. They want to know how to you. And then they want to, they want to try to throw a little uh, inside running in. Like they want to keep you off guard, keep you keep you honest, and make you play kind of like a, a up the post style. And try to get you off your uh, get you off your techniques and try to make you run around, get you tired. Try to get the D lineman off the field and try to keep you out of, uh, try to keep themselves out of third and long situations. So if we get them in some third and long situations, we feel like we can have a great day. Any of their offensive linemen stand out to you? Uh, no, not really. I mean, they just ride us out all the offensive linemen in the country, so no, not really. Do you know which one you'll be going up against most of the time? Freshman, 75. We'll Mitch Hyatt. Uh -huh. What do you see out of him on film, and does he look like a true freshman? Oh, yeah, he looks like a true freshman. He's going to be very good. I mean, he's still young right now, has a lot of things to develop. He's kind of light, so it's going to be fun. He's an All-American, so it's always fun going against an All-American. Freshman All-American, high school All-American. Either way, he's an All-American, so it's always fun going against those kind of players.